hey, it's Julie Kalen, your voice of happiness. And I wanted to share a voiceover that I recorded a few years back for United States Senate campaign. And I think it's super cool that my voice um, can influence, you know, U.S. politics and U.S. Senate races, even in its own small little way. And I really thought that you would enjoy hearing this. And before I play it for you, though, I just wanted to remind you to appreciate this voiceover for its artistic value and its voice artistry. Do not think that I am promoting any one particular political candidate or political party or political cause on my channel because I am not. I personally think um, the more time that you spend not focusing on politics, the happier you will be. Um, but, um, you know, me personally, as a voiceover artist, um, I'm very bipartisan. You know, I will um, record commercials for Democrats, Republicans, um, you know, liberals, conservatives, and anywhere in between, just because I do enjoy the um, artistry of um, political voiceovers so much. Because, um, you know, in this commercial that you will hear um, coming up, it's a, a radio commercial, so you'll, so you'll hear it. Um, I get to sound very like appalled and kind of angry and sad in this commercial. And for, you know, a lot of other um, commercials, that I record for new products or new services. Most of the time I'm sounding like really happy or really excited about a new uh, product or service that's coming out. And I don't usually get to show that other side um, of um, my voice that's sounding more sad or more shame on you kind of, kind of uh, angry kind of tone or appalled tone. So you get to hear that other um, vocal side of me in this um, commercial that's coming up right here. Really hope that you enjoy it. And, you know, if you have a favorite political candidate that you want me to do the voiceover for, feel free to send them my info and maybe I'll get to do the voiceover for one of your favorite political candidates, whoever they might be. So in the meantime, enjoy this commercial coming up right now. And until the next video, I am wishing you much happiness and joy. Okay, enjoy the commercial. Shame on Evan Bai. When Indiana's pro-life community needed him, he caved into President Obama, casting one of the last deciding votes to force Obamacare on us all. We warned Evan Bai of abortion problems in Obamacare, concerns echoed by the U.S. Conference of Catholic Bishops and thousands of Evan Bai constituents. But Evan Bai put party politics ahead of the right to life for defenseless unborn children. Voting for Obamacare's huge takeover of our health care. The Obamacare Evan Bai voted for is history's largest abortion expansion and an assault on our religious freedoms. And we haven't forgotten that as governor of Indiana, Evan Bai blocked pro life legislation while abortion soared. If Evan Bai sold us out on Obamacare, will he sell us out again? Shame on you, Evan Bai. Unborn children needed you, but you chose party politics. Indiana Right to Life Incorporated is responsible for the content of this advertising.